two days ago, my coffee, and today's ordination consecration of our new bishop of Bungoma, Mark Kadima. Mark Karibu to the conference of bishops. Here are your brothers, like Jesus said. Here are your brothers. Here are your brothers and sisters in Bungoma. And as we thank God for this opportunity, we are not just thanking God because of Bungoma, no. He's a member of a big family called the Catholic Church, but he has done such a wonderful work, even beyond some of us didn't even know him. So thank you for being a good ambassador for us in Sudan, that they chose you. And in fact, the delegation with us is clearly an indication of what person you are there. You went you did your best. So congratulations. As meant to be reminded of the reasons we are here. God doesn't make mistakes. He chose you. He has chosen this moment at a particular time because we need more shepherds. We still need more shepherds. There are still thousands out there. And because we need more shepherds, especially these moments of our history in the world, and in particular our challenges in Kenya and beyond, where sometimes you think things are upside down. Indeed in Kenya, this is the year of elections. And all around the corner, everybody's talking about it. We need good leaders. You have shown us how a good leader can be. We need leaders who have hearts that care for others. You did that. You've been proven to do that. You need men and women who are ready to lay their lives for the sake of the flock. Shepherds guided by inner conviction that Christ has called them. Guided by the rule of law, peace and justice. May I echo the voice of one man who is a member of this community, the son of this land from Chebukwa village, and our first cardinal in Kenya. He reminded us many times over, saying, stand strong in faith, be united, not just as a tribe, or blood brothers, or affiliation, but because we have one faith in Christ. And so, God may protect us as we welcome you to this conference of bishops, and once again saying, thank you for accepting. You could have said, no, sorry, I can't make it, but you found it in your good heart to say yes, like Mary. God bless you, nakaribu sana. Wapopote mlipo ama Kenya Na amini ni mda wa wetu wa peke Kuendelea kusikia sauti ya viongozi wetu Wanao tuambia Hata kama ni mwaka wa, wa uchaguzi Sharti tuweze kupiga kura hizo kwa hali ya amani We all ask everyone Those who are prepared for war Drop your guns, drop your arrows, drop your weaponry. Use the weapon of love and bring about caring communities where we will walk that morning of the 9th of August to place our choice without intimidation. Bila kuogopa au kuogopesha wengine. Nalamwisho basi. Ujumbe wa maaskofu ni kuwakumbusha tuwe wanaweza kusimama pale pale tulipo kutetea haki za wengine hasa nyakati kama hizi ambapo tunaona watu wakiuana watu wakipigana 
na watu wakisemezana vibaya let's be our brothers and sisters keepers kwa haya machache napenda niachie and therefore we have the motto there nothing is possible with god and inside it there are those documents you begin to read when you are alone in your own room to understand the conference and to appreciate your coming to join us we are going to fight together all that we need to fight to make the church present karibu sana karibu sana